No, oops, I'm just getting stung here. No. Makes a good uh, opportunity to show how to get uh, what you want to do is uh, see the, can you, can you get focused? Yep, right I'm on it. Okay, so I would normally be doing this much more quickly, but right. for educational purposes, you just want to have the fingernail or the blade of your blade of your knife or a hive tool or whatever, uh, just quickly scrape that, scrape that loose uh, so that you can minimize the amount of venom that's being pumped in there. And uh, give, it a, give it a blow of some smoke to uh, cover, the, cover the odor. And go. Okay, so I'm just going to give him uh, give another blast of smoke. Uh, in general, uh, when you want to, when you, when it's, you can tell when it's time to give the bees some more smoke. Uh, is they'll start to line up uh, at the top of the top bars and kind of be up looking at you is the way mm -hmm. I think of it. Um, you might be able to hear, I'm trying to keep the smoker going with my foot as I, as I uh, talk along. Ouch! Anybody else? Yeah, hurt. Are we good? Back on. Are we on? <laughs> I just took a uh, I just took a sting to the eye, which uh, even though I'm fairly fairly used to uh, to uh, bee stings, that's a fairly fairly painful spot to get stung. Again, if these were African bees, I wouldn't be anywhere near this colony without a veil on uh, if I were doing hive manipulation. If you were just opening up, if you were just opening up the colony to take a to take a quick look, and we're just removing empty frames, you might you might do this without a veil on. But it would be really risky. I, mm -hmm. I wouldn't recommend it. I, with, with African bees, uh, I always recommend wearing wearing your veil. And even if you're wearing equipment, it's a good idea to smoke yourself smoke yourself down real well. Um, sometimes you can get away with with uh, with working with African bees uh, in in bare hands, um, but uh, uh, your with the, for your facial protection, I wouldn't risk it. Because mm -hmm. uh, they can react so fast, you just find yourself with a with a Massive face full of change. bees. If you one wrong move, and and uh, you can you know, easily be blinded by pain, and then you're stumbling <laughs> into the hive, and not a good idea. But you do generally recommend uh, not using gloves just for that I, I sense don't like of to feel. Use gloves because yeah, because it's a lot easier to, to keep track of of uh, whether it's time to close the hive down right. or not. If, if you're getting stung a lot, in spite of the fact that you're uh, that you're you've smoked your your uh, hands, then you're probably doing something wrong, or there's something wrong with the nest, and it's probably best to leave them alone.